Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing the Alta Beauty Endless Eyes um, 40 piece eyeshadow palette. And this came out last year in the holidays. And there is quite a few fall colors in here. So that's why I dug it out for the fall. Because you can create so many fall colors and I wanted to play with orange, a little bit of green, a little bit of purple, and some brown. So mainly I dug into like this part of the palette. I used this color, these two oranges, I used this color, and then I went up here used this purpley pink color, and then I used this like green color right here to create this eye look and yes I put it dark over here when it's supposed to be a light lighter but you know what you don't have to go by everybody else to do an eye look I created this by myself <laughs> I was like maybe I should have put the green over here and then no you don't have to <laughs> So this is what I created and it's fall. Be creative with fall colors. So these are the brushes that I have used as you can see <laughs> the colors. So yeah, let's get started. I don't want to bore you too much. Um, so I went in with both orange, the darker orange, of course, and they both look the same. So. I already primed my eye and I always put like highlighter up here and the fair uh, the moda brushes are okay then I'm gonna go in with the lighter color in the inner crease and then blend those out um these are really like I don't really care for these motor brushes. I like to try out brushes because I like brushes, but you really have to work with these kind of brushes. I went a little crazy too high, <laughs> but you can always wipe it down. No worries. To the, um, level of height that you are comfortable with and next color I will be digging into and brush is this brown color I hate holding these up so I used these two oranges of course and then this brown color next i hate when i do this because i feel like it's gonna like break or rip when i see everybody else fold their palettes like that i feel like it's not good so i'm just going in the outer part of the eye and then up higher in this part and then just going in and the pigmentation is okay in this palette it's like not the best but it works and it has a bunch of neutrals in this palette so you can you know pop of color but with a lot of neutrals they have berry tones which is good because I didn't think I had any berry tone um, shadows. So, and there's a, lo a little bit of fallout. So I'm going in with this pinky purple color. And going in with this shade brush. And just going in the middle of the eye look with this color. You might have to um, spray 
or use water. Water, I think this is just a water because it says rose water. So you can just spray it on contact of anywhere. I don't spray like right on my table, I just spray. So I'm going to use a little bit of rose water toner. Any kind of water is just perfect. It is just water. And get that little bit more pigmentation in. I go a little bit further this way with the color. And that's what it looks like so far. Going in with this brush and this color, green, shimmery. So there is bunch of shimmers, bun bunch of mattes in this palette. I think it's pretty good. I don't know if they'll come back out with this palette again. So I only, I only, this is the, like the first time I actually went to Ulta and got Ulta Beauty palette. Because usually I used to go with drugstore brands and then I was like, I never went to Ulta before and I wanted to go last year, so I went. And I picked up this, and it was on sale, but the lady didn't charge me sale price. So this was like $18, which is reasonable. You get 40 shades, and they're pretty good size pan shades, so... Really not hating on this palette at all. Because you do get a lot of shades for like 20 bucks. And you can't beat that. So I'm going in with... If I can find it. Oh, this color. I'm going in in the inner part of the eye and then I bring it up here where the orange is and just swiping it <laughs> so it looks like that oh by the way I got this done and this done but I always have to fix this and you can flip it up to hide it and it didn't hurt it was like a pinch and this one hurt a little bit just a little bit more than this just like I felt like she had trouble putting this through but other than that it was fine no tears were out of my eyes. <laughs> I'm going to clean this brush a little bit because I used this again. And going in, I think it was in this orange right here that I dug in. Yeah, it was. I had to remember a little bit. Going in, and under my eye, I used this color. And black eyeliner. Halloween month. Do you guys know what you're doing for Halloween? Oh wait, it's next month. Well, I'm already thinking about October. What are you guys going to do for Halloween though? 
I have no clue what I'm going to do. It's up in the air. <laughs> Everything's like up in the air this year for me because I don't know what to do for my birthday this year. And that's in November. And I'm still like, what do I do on my 30th birthday? I have no clue for anything this year. I'm taking a long time to do my mascara because I hate doing mascara on this side of my eye. Like I'm pretty good at this eye with mascara and this eye. Ha. <laughs> it's a joke. So that's what it looks like. Maybe I should go a little bit thicker on this eye. Lashes just. Yes, no, I want to work. <laughs> I don't want to work. I don't know. But I tried to make it quick for this video. What do you think about this eye look? It's more pumpkin-y vibe going on with all the orange, but yeah. So this is what it looks like in the inside. Hopefully it comes out again if you like this palette. It was for the holidays last year and this retails for $18. It says a $50 value, but it's also beauty. It's like cheaper than Too Faced and all the other brands. So you can create a bunch of fall looks with this, neutral looks, pop of color looks, any kind of looks with this. And if you're new to makeup, I think this would be great to play around with. But yeah, please like, subscribe, and comment to my channel. This is the final look. Thank you for watching. Bye now.